G'day guys, this is Booze Review, the show where we review the booze. Came across something I've never seen in the bottle shop today. Carlsberg Elephant. It's been recommended before actually, when I've done a uh, malt liquor video. I think I did the Colt 45 video and someone recommended doing Carlsberg Elephant. But yeah, I saw it in the bottle shop recently and I thought, man, i got to get that. 7.2% ABV, which means it's a malt liquor. What you know about that? <laughs> Probably nothing. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, so this is a premium strong lager. First introduced in 1959, so it's been around for a while. Cool bottle design, kind of old and simplistic, classic Carlsberg font with an elephant, seen here. So yeah, anyway, 330 mils. You get it in bottles. I don't know if you get it in cans or whatever, but yeah. 1.9 standard drink, so this will uh, kick your pants. Kick you right in the pants, that's for sure. Got the uh, bottle cap. Like a snowflake, I think. But yeah, typical Carlsberg green bottle. But yeah, I'm going to crack this boy open. So yeah, it costs about 24 bucks for a six pack, which uh, considering it's 7.2% is... Average price. It's nothing good, but it's not terrible. So yeah, it's gonna give it a a little pour. There we go. Look at that. Looks quite nice. Maybe got about a centimeter of pretty white, creamy looking head. Um Beer is pretty typical. Minimal carbonation, I will say, though, which is intriguing. Almost looks a bit cloudy, too, oddly enough. Although, that might just be the uh, the glass starting to, you know, cool up and sort of start uh, frost, not frosting, start clouding up itself. But, um, yeah, it, eh, yeah, it almost, you know, kind of has like a slight kind of cloudy look to it. I'm not too sure. Head's kind of dissipated pretty fast there. Typical kind of Pilsner look, I guess. But anyway, yeah. I've been enjoying these, by the way. I've already had a couple. I'm not going to pretend that I've, you know, oh man, I've never had this before. Yeah, I bought a six pack. I've had like three of them tonight, so I'm like kind of slightly pissed. But anyway, we'll go for the aroma. Yeah, you get the nice hit of malts there immediately. Nice malty smell. Typical beer smell. Kind of, you can... Smell the uh, alcohol, kind of, very, it's, it's vague, but it's there. But anyway, yeah, it looks pretty good, and I'm going to give it a try. I'll shut up now and give it a try. Cheers. Yeah, very nice. Very nice, very nice for a malt liquor, very smooth. You can taste the alcohol, but it's, um, it's hidden, it's kind of, um, it's presented rather well where you can't, it's not, you know, an offensive taste. It is quite nice and smooth. Obviously, you got a nice, uh, kind of a slightly sweet malt hit with the, um, you know, you know, slight bitterness of the hops. It's pretty well balanced, I think. Obviously, malt liquor needs to be served cold. If you have this warm, it's going to taste a lot worse. So, yeah, it's nice and cold. Got a bit of lacing. Around the glass there, which looks kind of cool. I'm going to give it another sip. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah, that's really nice. Really, really nice. Mmm. So, yeah. Uh, Carlsberg Elephant. Pretty impressed by it, actually. I remember when I had my first one yesterday, I was like, wow, it's pretty good. But, yeah. Um, I haven't actually seen this before you know, in any bottle shops, but I happened to come by the last like, two days ago, and um, yeah, I was you know quite surprised. I got a lot of new good. I've noticed in the bottle shops, and Swilling Grog recently talked about this. A lot of the bottle shops in Australia seem to have um, got a lot of good European imports. Um, you know, like a lot of German kind of Polish beers, like a lot of you know stuff that we don't usually get. And I think Carlsberg Elephant may be something that we don't usually get. I'm not sure. Well, I've never seen it before, so shit. 
Anyway, yeah, so that's uh, that's something interesting to note. But anyway, I'll take one final sip and uh, I'll give you my final score. Cheers. Hmm. Yeah, it's just a good strong lager malt liquor overall. Um, it's pretty good in general. It's balanced rather well. The alcohol, you can detect it, but it's um, you know. It's it's pretty smooth. It's not really offensive tasting. It's you know it's pretty good overall. Um, certainly does not really taste like it's seven point two percent, especially when it's cold. You know, so yeah, it's pretty it's great. You know, great product overall. I'm happy that I bought it, and I'm happy that I'm trying it and reviewing it. But yeah, Carlsberg Elephant Man, not bad. Very interesting. I'll definitely recommend it if you're into strong lagers or if you're a fan of Carlsberg because this does actually have the, the uh, classic Carlsberg taste. Um, um, when I immediately started drinking it, I'm like, yeah, no, it does taste like Carlsberg, just like stronger. So anyway, guys, if you, you know, enjoy my videos, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, do whatever you want. And um, yeah, I'll see you next time. Cheers.